show you how to de-seed pepper juice. Even though it sounds simple, it took us a while to figure out the best way of de-seeding them. These are our beautiful pepper juice from our garden. A friend of mine gave me some seeds and we've got so many now. So we're eating them and we're going to pickle them and we're going to grill them. Um, and I'm going to make pickled pepper juice and I'm going to make stuffed pepper juice with cheese and grill them in the oven and they are so yummy. But first we've got to get the seeds out. The seeds are precious. We want to keep the seeds, give them away, grow them, grow more, grow lots. So I'm going to show you a quick way. The first <laughs> day, way that we did it was like this. We got a sharp knife, cut off the top, cut the top off, keep it for your compost, keep everything for your compost. Nothing must leave your sides, your sides and your sides. <laughs> and then just a teaspoon. Scoop out the seeds. Ta da! There we go. And now I've got an even easier way of doing it, a better way. I've just figured it out today. Maybe you guys have figured this out already, but this for me is just so quick. So I'm going to cut around the stalk. Ow. And the seeds just come out. How cool! You just cut around the stalk, seeds are out. Takes five seconds. And then you keep them. These seeds, these seeds, we're just going to keep inside here. Um, let them dry out and then we can plant. Separate them obviously from the stalk. Get rid of the seeds. But I don't even do that. I just throw the whole thing inside, wait for them to dry a bit, leave them on a sunny windowsill. And then we've got beautiful seeds and we can replant them. Mix this with um, vinegar and a bit of sugar. If you don't want to use sugar, you can probably even use honey. But we use some sugar, brown sugar, non-GM. And um, garlic and water. And then you just kind of boil them inside together. And then you clean your jar with nice boiling water. And there we go. You've got your pickled pepper juice. They are so yum. So yum.